You are here to have an electroencephalogram called an EEG or video electroencephalogram called a VEEG. An EEG is a test that uses special sensors placed all over the head that measure the electrical signals your brain sends out. Those signals are recorded so the doctor can see them. The setup takes about two hours. Running the actual EEG takes about 20 to 40 minutes. These tests are painless. There are no shots or needles. A VEEG is an EEG that runs all the time to check your brain's normal and seizure signals. If you are having a VEEG, you will have to stay at Children's for a couple of days. Parents must stay with their child during the VEEG to identify what they are seeing at home and answer any questions. Before you can have one of these tests, there are a few things to remember. Wash your hair the day of the test. Once your hair is clean, do not put any oils, gels, sprays, or lotions in your hair. This will help the sensors stick to your scalp. If you are having an EEG or VEEG, you also can't have any refined sugars or caffeine, like candy and soda, one whole day, 24 hours, before the test, because the sugar and caffeine will make your brain react differently to the test. Lastly, if you are older than 13 months, you need to be really sleepy for the test. The night before the test, you need to miss at least four hours of sleep. This is really important because parts of the test are done while you are asleep and awake. Try to follow all these instructions. If you don't follow these instructions, we may have to reschedule the test for another day. When you have an EEG, the technician will make little marks on your head with a wax pencil. Then, those marks will be scrubbed with a gritty gel. After that, you will get about 20 sensors placed on your head with some gel to keep them in place. Then, the technologist will wrap your head up with some gauze to keep the wires from moving. After the technician checks all the sensors, there are four different parts to the EEG. First, the technician will take a base reading while you are awake. You can relax and watch TV during this part. Then, you will breathe quickly for three minutes. Next is the easy part. The technician will turn out the lights and you will sleep for 10 to 15 minutes. The last part uses a series of flashing lights to test your reaction. You can keep your eyes closed through this part as long as you don't go to sleep. Once the technician gets all the data he needs, he will take off the gauze and sensors. All the gel from the sensors will still be in your hair, but it will come off when you wash your hair with regular shampoo. Your doctor will get the results of your test in about three business days. Tell your doctor we are happy to talk with him or her about the results of your test. Thank you for choosing Children's Healthcare of Atlanta.